I think game, we've, what we've seen from games so far is just the beginning of what this medium is capable of doing. There's already artistic achievement there. I don't think there's a question that games have become an art, but I think they can become a richer and deeper art. It takes a while for artists to really get inside a medium deep enough to understand what this medium is capable of doing. In a narrative uh, experience like reading a book or seeing a movie, you essentially want to know what happened to someone else, what choices did they make, and how did it turn out. We play games to get some useful information that's somehow linked uh, deep in our brains to survival skills. And with a game, it's about, well, what should I do, and what skills should I develop, and what choices should I make? At our best, we can bring people together in a way that's even harder to do in theater and film because they are doing things together. They are setting out upon the quest together. They are facing the dangers. They are discussing the options. They're making decisions. And they're building community. But the soil from which every one of those things grew is a dream. And if you can picture that dream and how it turned into something, you understand games better and how games are made. Our industry is a huge and beautiful place filled with people that are creative and talented who want to share experiences with other people. Play enriches your life. Video games have the capacity to connect people and help them share their feelings, their thoughts, that shows their true creative spirit. The future of video games is really going to be in the storytelling and the emotional connection. Whether you play games or not, millions of people all over the world have such an emotional connection to this industry and to these games and these characters on so many different levels. Games aren't just blowing things up. Games aren't just looking at pixels moving around and trying to get a high score. Let's do the helicopter. I'd love to see them enrich somebody's life by helping them learn to feel more, learn to love more, learn to invest more in the world around them. Start thinking about the stories behind all of these games. Start asking what stories you have to tell. Maybe it's not that the invention of computers that's interesting. It's the way computers through games are changing our lives that's interesting. Computers are just a mechanism through which our whole world is going to change around interactivity. You know, you had the industrial age, you know, and what age is this? Is like the information age or something like that? Maybe it's not. Maybe it's the game age.